Powtoon Demo for Animation Videos, Powtoon Tutorial. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today I will be showing you how you can get started with creating your own animated videos using Powtoon. So let's get into it. So first off, all you have to do is head on over to powtoon.com and click on sign up over here. The sign up process is very simple. You can use Google or Facebook to sign up or you can just enter your email address. I'm going to continue over here with Google. And Powtoon enables you to create animated videos for free and they also have some premium versions where you can create more detailed and more interesting videos with their different templates. So you can see once you have signed up, this is going to be your basic dashboard. So from here, you can see on the left side, you have a navigation panel where you have your home, you have templates, import blank. So you can import any of your previously created material over here as well. So if you previously created a animation or you previously have something that you want to work from, then you can also import that over here as well. Now we're going to continue on with create and we can also take a look at the different templates. So you can use one of these templates for an animated video as well. You can see they have a bunch of different uh, presentation templates, you could say, and they have uh, a bunch of different categories on the top as well. But we want to continue on with animation, so we're just going to click on create. And then once you click on create, they give you quite a few different options. So you can see that not only can you create a simple uh, animated explainer, but you can also create a whiteboard video. You can see a lot of YouTube videos have those, you know, whiteboards where a hand is writing the story and they're showing it. Then you also have presentations, branded characters, so on and so forth. So we're going to continue on with animated explainer. Now, once you click on animated explainer, this will show you all the templates that you can use for a animated explainer. So you can see these are all explainer videos. So so uh, you can see all of these are available on the pro version. A lot of templates are available on the pro version, but they also have free templates as well. So you don't have to worry about that. So I'm just going to search for, I just searched for animated and you can see there are a bunch of different story time or a bunch of different templates I can choose from. You can choose whatever template suits you the best, or you can even get started from scratch. Now I'm just going to select this template from over here. It's a simple graduation template and I can click on edit in studio. And now I can begin creating my own animated video or presentation. You can easily create it in step-by-step -step and presentation formats so it's easier for uh, you to create them. Because a lot of the times when you're not used to creating animated explainers, it can be a little difficult to continue on with a template where it's just based on video. But it's a lot easier to handle it when you are doing it in terms of a presentation or slide-by-slide -slide video. So you can see this is our first little section where we have this little animated cartoon over here you can see how it's going to be so if i click on the play button on the bottom i can preview it like this and then it will show me exactly how everything is going to be like so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to begin customizing it so i can click on this little character over here and i can click on delete i can click on swap i can click on swap over here and i can add my own image instead of this person's face i can add my own face i can add my own character i can add my own image so let's say i want to click on characters instead of uh, using like this little image i want to use a character so i will just click on that and i will unlock this go into these settings and i will simply delete this character from over here and I will go into the character section on the right side of your screen so you can see a little navigation panel to add more items. You can add scenes, backgrounds, text, characters, props, shapes, images, videos, music, and specials as well. So if I click on characters over here, I can click on the different types of characters that are available. So let's say I want to create a character like uh, a girl over here. So I will take this female character. I can just enter that. Now I can uh, enter where I want this to, you know, stop appearing. So for that, I can just lock this in and then I can split it from over here. So you can simply go into your video editor and you can click on add a second, you know, added one more second. So now it's uh, added another second till this. And now I can just simply take this over here and I'm going to remove the character at this second and now the character will be removed. So once you have added your character, added your own character, we can begin customizing our text. So let's say I want to add, you know, a basic intro. So let's say I want a more basic intro type of video. So I'm just going to customize the little items that we have and I'm going to remove the bottom text over here. 
Now, if I go on ahead and move the preview button to the start, and now it just says hello, and that is it. Now, after that, maybe I want to remove one second like this. So now I've removed a couple of seconds from the first slide, like so. And now after that, I have this. Maybe I don't want this. I'm just going to delete it. And I can take the first slide once more, and I can click on duplicate over here. So I can duplicate the background for the entire first slide. And then I can go ahead and design it further. So I can just click on the items that I don't want. I can use my same character. I can add, you know, another version. So this is the version where she's explaining something. And now I can go into the props over here. And I can go into free props over here. And you can see you have a bunch of different things. So uh, let's say I want to add a simple little background. So I will add, I'm just searching for a whiteboard over here. And now I'm adding this little bubble text over here. So like this, I can add this little bubble text. And now I can go into the text section over here. And I will simply go into the text section. And you can see you have titles, you have elements, you have badges for text as well. So you can add text like that in a more fashionable way. But I'm just going to add a basic title text over here. So whatever text it might be, I'm just going to place that. You can click on the text and you have font option, color options, opacity options, so on and so forth. And now I'm just going to resize the text from over here like this. And now I'm going to place the text in my little bubble. I can also, you know, change the size of our bubble like this. And now this is our second video animation. So this is how it's going to be. I'm going to remove, I'm going to place all of these things at the start all together because I want them to appear all together like so and I'm going to delete this item and from here I'm going to remove a couple of extra seconds because I think the text is pretty short now if I go back into my first little animation continuing on from here this is how it's going to look like and you can keep on designing it further and create your own animated videos using Powtoon. It's so simple and easy. Now, once you have created your video, you can click on the top right over here to preview your video, how it's going to look finalized. And then you can click on export and you have different options such as sharing the link, downloading images, downloading the animated GIF, create a video page, sharing it on MS, Teams, YouTube, or downloading the PowerPoint presentation version. But if you want to download the mp4 version which is the video version which you would probably be focused on uh, you do have to subscribe to the premium version but if we take a look at their premium plans they only start at $20 per month and the pro plus plan starts at $60 per month so I hope you guys found this video helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel and I will catch you guys in the next video